So this is a box that I got on eBay. It's very exciting. There are film reels in this box that I haven't looked at yet. And I got it off of this eBay posting, which has a bunch of random reels from a theater that closed down. I think it's in Kansas City, Missouri. They're supposedly from the 80s. So I'm just, I just ordered two because I have no self-control and you can order up to three, I think. And it's just like a grab bag. So you get random reels, so much fun. Watch me not even like know, <laughs> like not even know what films these are. But you know, I'm a, um, I have a film degree, so um, I'll most likely know what they are. So here's the first reel. It's on a shipping reel. Oh, there's like a cobweb on this reel. That's so cool. It's very authentic. Okay, this is tail one. So it's backwards. This is from New Line Cinema. It has the, so this is reel two. And it says rooftops. I'm giving it the smell test. Doesn't smell vinegary, so that's good. Okay, here is the second one. If I can slide it out. There we go. Okay, who is it? This is real five called from a film called 1969. Print number 49 and it is on safety film. I am going to, I don't know if this is Tails Out or not. They did not specify. The other one is Tails Out, which means the last time that was ran was probably during its original run. I am going to look at these two reels and then I will be back with you very shortly. I wanna get you guys some images of some of the frames. So, Hey guys, you can't really see me, but I thought instead of just showing you frames and talking about it, I would just show you um, the reel rewinding on my rewind desk while I talk briefly about this reel. We're going to talk about 1969, which was the second reel I pulled out in the video prior. So this is in really good condition. There aren't really any scratches or anything, and um, there's probably going to be a lot of great pictures that I can take. So, 1969, which I had never heard of, um, I kind of have a gap in 80s cinema knowledge, um, so, you know, I'm learning. In 19, so the film 1969 is a film that was shot in 1988. It stars Robert Downey Jr., Kiefer Sutherland, and Bruce Dern. The film focuses on um, the Vietnam War and the resulting social tensions between those who supported the war and those who opposed it in small town America. So I looked up the reviews of this film because, you know, I was actually genuinely interested and <laughs> uh, the reviews were rather like lukewarm. You know, um, basically a lot of the reviews claimed that the film was rather just an aimless drama that didn't really have like a strong plot or you know have a strong purpose it seems to lose its purpose in the fog of the nostalgia um, that it portrays and there's not a lot of interesting trivia surrounding the film's production like I actually looked you know I was like I love trivia so I was actually kind of interested in some behind the scenes on this film but I really couldn't find a lot of info on it but I still think it's a fun reel that, you know, hopefully I'll get to watch someday. I like learning about different films, and this has Winona Ryder in it. She plays a little bit of a smaller character in this film. I think she's the girlfriend that Kiefer Sutherland and Robert Downey Jr. fight over. I'm not sure. Anyway, um, I hope I'm able to watch it soon. So, I heard some stickiness with this one. This one is Rooftops. Um, <laughs> so we'll see how it goes. 
Can you hear that? ASMR. 305. Film hasn't been run in a while, huh? This reel is Rooftops. So this is reel five. I think this one is the one that might have said that it was tails out. They're both, both of these reels are actually heads out. Um, so Rooftops is kind of a crazy wild ride, um, just from its description, description, but Rooftops is described as a crime and dance drama film directed by Robert Wise. Woo! Robert Wise rules. I love Robert Wise. Uh, the crazy synopsis of this film is that a roof-dwelling combat dancer loves a crack king's sister in Manhattan. Like, what? <laughs> okay. It stars Jason Gedrick, Troy Bayer, and Eddie Velas. The film is uh, has a 0% rating on Rotten Tomatoes, and Roger Ebert described it as unrealistic due to its sugar-coated approach towards teen homelessness. So, you know, um, wow, that'll be a really interesting film to watch. Uh, but yeah, it looks good so far. There's not a lot of splices, you know. Um, there's one with the head and the tail, but I think it looks pretty good. Um, I really like terrible movies, so I'm, I'm down to watch this. And if you've seen any either of these films, let me know. I want to know what you think um, because they they both sound kind of interesting in terrible ways. <laughs> I wanted to say thank you guys for watching. And um, if I get any other crazy films from eBay, I will definitely share them with you in the future. Okay, bye.